Our mission is to help people who are unable to help themselves. We seek to provide personalized problem-solving services for incarcerated men and women statewide in Michigan to enable them to be humanized. I think Humanity for Prisoners uh, provides unique support to people who are incarcerated in the state of Michigan. I'm not aware of another organization which uh, provides the same kinds of services that HFP does. Our vision for the organization is to have everyone in the Michigan Department of Corrections understand that they matter as an individual. The system doesn't really care because we're designed to punish. And if they hadn't done a crime, they wouldn't be doing the time. They're just a prisoner. But really, they're not just a prisoner. They're created in the image of God. So we've got to give them that humane treatment. And we found over a period of time that we can make things happen. I don't think there's any other organization in the state that does what we do and the prisoner population is extremely underserved. We offer that compassion to people inside who might not have it otherwise. The general attitude remains lock them up and throw away the key. And humanity for prisoners has a listening ear just to be heard and to be told that, hey, somebody cares about you. You matter. That concept is, is just wonderful. They provide the support by just being there for people. It shows someone cares. For some people, we're the only contact they have. And that's a huge, huge thing. And it's a big responsibility. So we provide health care advocacy. We provide representation with the parole board. We provide commutation preparation. We provide re-entry packets to people who need help with preparing for reintegration back into society. We provide referrals. We're walking alongside people through their journey behind bars. I was incarcerated for 32 years for a crime I did not commit. While you're inside, you really need somebody to be that, uh, uh, be that voice of concern. But uh, finding somebody that cares that you can call is an is a insurmountable task for a lot of people. So uh, they're invaluable. It's an extension of the, of the prisoner when they don't have a voice on the outside. Once you are, are oppressed for so long, you know, and depression set in, then you have, you know, other, you know, issues developing within yourself, you know. Uh, it's just bad. It's bad all the way around, you know. Without the assistance, I don't think that I've been able to evolve into the type of person I have uh, become. They change lives, you know, and I think that's the greatest gift another human being can give another. I'm very late in life learned that this is where I belong and I love it. I love working with and for these people. I love what we do and I want to do more. The future is wide open for humanity for prisoners. I like to envision a future where, you know, we, we can cover a larger geographic area, grow our services, create greater awareness, and continue to serve a disenfranchised population.